Hi, Sarah. Um, thank you very much for agreeing to talk to us about your microteach. Perhaps you can tell us a little bit, first of all, about uh, your feelings um, as you prepared for this part of the course. Were you apprehensive at all? At, um, I think the answer is probably, of course. I think that everybody is going to be apprehensive before something like this. Yes. Um, I did mine on creating accessible um, web documentation, which is something that I'm absolutely passionate about. Mm. And one thing that I would recommend um, to everybody else doing the qualification is that they should do something that they're passionate about too, because it's going to show and it's going to benefit you no end. Yes, absolutely. I'd agree with that. Um, so how long was your actual presentation in the end? I, I think I was actually quite precise about the 20 minutes but I did have to um, cut out a video as I went along and there are areas that I covered a little bit quicker than I would really have liked to have done. Yeah, so if you were going to give some advice about the planning for the micro teach, would you suggest to learners that they, they perhaps trim things down a little bit? Um, certainly, be careful about your timings and remember no matter how nervous you are, um, it's always, um, it's always um, easier to talk more than to talk less. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, so, um, what do you recall about the micro teachers that other people did? Um, a lot of them were based around their um, the areas that they worked in, and it was really interesting to see everybody's different backgrounds and the things they were interested in. Yeah, I know you used a mic. Uh, you used PowerPoint. Was that the case for everybody who did the uh, their? Um, I don't completely remember, but I think most people did. Yeah. I think some people used Word documents. Mm. And honestly, if I had the chance to do it again, I would probably use um, something a little bit more tech forward, such as Prezi. Yes. So Certainly take a look and see what software is out there that can um, show off your skills to their, be to their best. Okay, good. So that's something for people to think about. Um, finally, do you have any other tips um, for, uh, for people who are about to embark on this process? I would say don't overthink it. I spent hours and days and weeks worrying about it. Um, I prepared all manner of things and then I think by the time it got to about um, a week or two beforehand I just sort of ripped up everything I'd done and I started again from scratch and I really went back to basics. So I'd advise you to try and start from that point rather than driving yourself loopy over it. Yeah, so it's it's the old KISS mantra, keep it simple, exactly. stupid. Exactly. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. a firm believer in that, yes. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, um, that's super, Sarah. Thank you so much for agreeing to talk to us.